we did our own thing, so we've been our own fashion mm -hmm. collections since '96, showing in Paris, London, and, and then stopping doing the fashion consultancy and just working mainly in the background of the fashion companies as design directors, mm -hmm. and then doing lots of collaborations for us. We've done the wallpapers. We've had we've been working with architects and interior designers sort of along the route, but never really kind of with a focused kind of effort into that world. Mm -hmm. It's a pleasure to let you have a look behind the brand room. Um, with obviously you're here to look at the wallpapers and how we do the wallpapers. Textile is um, our fundamental base. I'm a weaver, wax printer. And we started in '92, so we with with the with the wallpapers is 12 pieces of uh, archive. So this, this is our, uh, just a selection of our archive from our fashion collections that we we did in, we started in 1996. Um, we do about maybe to 12 prints a season, so that's kind of accumulated. And we just dipped into the archive. We chose 24 about a year ago. We thought we were incredibly ambitious with 24 after we sort of like six months into production. We realised that we have to cut it down to 12. And, and the reason why we started the wallpapers is because Steve downstairs, we employed him two years ago, he saw our, one of our tables which he got from St. Martin's, which is a narrow table full of fabric like everything else, full of stuff. And he said, I'll, I'll clear that away. And he said, I can print paper on it. Because that relationship of kind of the woman and us, they, they're the people who carry our work, so therefore they're the, they have a voice. And now I think we want to make the same relationships with home because we think it's an easy transferal. Where, and also we, we're empowering people hopefully by making the choice and making a commitment which is something quite strong and then the way that they collate this information with their own personal style is exactly the same as we saw the ladies who dress our collections so therefore there's a certain amount of individuality based upon that person investing in our work and feeling proud to, to kind of carry the strength of identity that we give and the reactions they get back to themselves. And the reactions they get back to themselves. Because the thing in normal wallpaper productions, they normally have like they print and they cut, where we just print to the edge, therefore we have to be super active. Uh, yeah. So we go through the finishing. Once it's printed and dried, we just roll it up and pack it and send it. Amazing. Um, there's obviously this, this nuances, there's nuances, there's a slight shift, or there's a little bit of misregistration, but then that comes in the natural accidents mm. of doing this table. Yeah. Um, the colour mixing and all that kind of stuff is kind of. We're very precise with that. There's huge technical books with dye mixing and everything. So Steve, the way the way that Steve works with black is like it's quite a methodical process of the kind of design with colour palette and sort of sort of swatches of colour and intermixed it and it's testing. So that's the kind of the method of uh, of the wallpaper production from now. We've got um, the the new fashion collection that we're developing now. It's um, we're utilising. All the same, we're basically doing fabric, fabric of the wallpaper. Cool. So we're blending the fashion very much with the what's within the book. 